Hi, so um, this is the Big Geordie Geek and I've been given a X-Wing Most Ponted Pack by Fantasy for Light to uh, open uh, to review. Um, disclaimer, they have given me some prizes for an upcoming uh, Wargaming weekend. I'm running Kings of the North. Um, they've given me a Tantive 4 um, for first prize, a Rebel Transport for second prize and a Most Wanted for third prize as well as a review copy of the brand new Most Wanted pack for me. Now. The most wanted pack uh, is something I've been very interested in. Uh, as you know, it adds a whole new faction, Scum and the Villainy. Um, and this pack comes with a two Z95 Headhunters and a Y-Wing. Now, the box itself... Um, this bit, I mean, yeah, it looks cool because you've got them flying through space. But it's a lot of it's a lot of space, you know, that, that's dead, essentially. So, uh, this is a bit of a... So, okay, so let's unbox this. So, let's take off the cellophane wrapping. Nothing better than that, is there? And see exactly how much, uh, you know, what's in the box. So, take this away so it's not... Yeah, I don't have a pristine white surface for doing this on, because this is my painting desk. Okay, so you get this. So, yeah, this is what I mean by... I mean, that is like over half the box, and it's just dead space. Uh, okay, so... Okay, so the models themselves, you've got your, your Y-Wing here. So, yeah. Y-Wing, uh, yeah, it looks, uh, looks good. Um, I like that it looks sort of... It's sort of got the, the, the hint of it being, you know, of its rebel lineage. And, and, and uh, it still looks a bit battered up, you know? It's, it's nice. Uh, it's a nice new paint job, you know, it's the same model essentially, but different paint job. Uh, the Z95, the paint job on these appears to be the same, although one is slightly... No, looks to be the same. I thought one might be slightly darker, but I think it's the light. So these, these are a bit tough to get out of the box, so anyway. Uh, yeah, Z95, again, you know, it's just... It's just a nice alternate... Uh, alternate uh, paint scheme which is cool um, the paint detail on them as always is you know it's not perfect but it's fantastic for for a game uh, of this size and for the price you're paying so let's see what's in the rest of the box I think yeah as you can see this uh, would have been better off taking out the other way but <laughs> yeah so this is basically most of what it is and again actually when you look at it it's, it's, it's taking up that much space so again it's it's, it's, it's it's almost like why are they giving you this much much a bigger box you know I prefer a smaller box it's it's cheaper to ship it's it'd be easier but anyway so you got uh, here we go we've got instruction pack credits you know, little sheet. So it's got your one Y wing, two Z ninety fives, three bases, six pegs, ten ship tokens, six maneuver dials, one focus token, two target locks, four stress tokens, seven shield tokens, twenty ship cards um, of your pilots and upgrade uh, 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 pilots and stuff, uh, including Boba Fett in the Scum and Villainy um, upgrade cards. Uh, ooh, Greedo, <laughs> uh, Astromex, various. So yeah, it's not it's not bad at all. Uh, you've got a lot in there. So, yeah, so you've got six styles. Now, the reason you've got six styles uh, and the uh, basis, you've got your cards here, Scum and Villainy, quite cool. Uh, the reason why you've got six bases is because this also allows you to upgrade a, uh, a Hawk, Freighter, a Slave 1, and another, another Y-Wing. So, essentially, by buying this box, if you've already got these ships lying around, and let's be honest, a lot of us are going to have these ships lying around um, because, you know, they were quite common. Um, Common ships, the Hawk, not so much common, but I have it. So you get, yeah, yeah you've got here, you've got uh, your Z95 Headhunters with the different you know, pilots, uh, Black Black Sun Soldier, Dance Bone Arm, Boba Fett in his scum and villainy form, different different ones, uh, more pilots. And yeah, so you get, you see, so you got uh, five dials here, fire spray. Uh, Zenit 500 headhunter, Zenit 500 headhunter, Y wing, Y wing, and tokens. So yeah, you can ha you've got essentially you've got the equipment here. If you've got those ships lying around, which I suppose a lot of us will have them lying around, um, you can essentially build yourself a whole new faction out of what you've already got, which is really cool. Um, it, it's a very good value pack uh, for what you get. Three ships. Uh, there's the bases. 
has the clips for the things and you want your cards here. So yeah, scammer villainy. So yeah, we've got some pilots, Z95 headhunter pilots, Black Sun Soldier, Black Sun Soldier, Pirate, Pirate, Boba Fett, obviously, um, slightly different from his Imperial, Taft Scarlet, Emma Nazaman, Maldivari Mercenary, Cavill for a Y Wing, Dera Ruffle for a Y Wing, Hide Gun for a Y Wing, Hide Gun for a Y Wing, Syndicate Fog, Syndicate Fog, Wearing, Dance Bone Arm for a Hawk, uh, Pablo Godai for a Hawk, Toro Mox for a Hawk, and Space Runner for a Hawk. So you've got quite a bit there. And then you've got your upgrade cards, not all of which are, are obviously which can be used by others. So you've got your an auto blaster turret, security droids, Greedo. Um, yeah, so he's a, so some of these are scum only, um, which is pretty cool. Oh, you got an outlaw tech. Houdini. Uh, bomb loadout, Y wing only. So yes, yeah, so you got some new, really cool upgrades, which could be used for obviously other factions as well. Salvaged astromech. Unhinged hotshot. Oh. A4 Y wings titles. Yeah, so that's that's pretty cool. Yeah, so I, I like the box. It's a bit too big. It's a, the, the box set is. It's a bit too big for what you get in it. I mean, it's huge considering what you actually get in here. Um, so yeah, the ships are all absolutely gorgeous, as normal with fantasy flight ships. Um, and yeah, the, the upgrades look good. It, it, it's a great way of, of of giving a new, whole new faction um, its ships and and bits as well. So I'm I'm really really happy with this, uh, and this will be added to my collection. I've got no idea how these are going to play yet. Uh, I'm gonna you know just get in there and play with them at some point. I do have to say I'm I'm, I'm getting them out of the box initially. They're they're quite tight. They're quite tight fit. So getting them out actually took a little bit of effort. I was a bit concerned I might break the ship there, but. Yeah, no, really cool. Uh, very well impressed with the package. And that's it. So, yay, that was an unboxing video. My first one, in fact. I um, hope you like it. Um, if you're interested in Kings of North, the tournament I mentioned earlier, you know, there's a link. And um, like and share. You know, comment, leave a comment below. And uh, maybe I'll do another one of these at some point. Uh, and, uh, and thanks for watching.